Hello again. Now, we've just completed step two with a coach who listens to us reading the words and we've circled the words on our worksheet, right? On our worksheet, we've circled the words that we need to correct. We're now ready to have the fun part. And this is the repetition over and over, but we're using story, we're thinking, we're thinking about the story of the song, and we're focusing on our worksheet so that we listen very carefully and mimic or make the same sounds and words as the singer. So here we go. I probably won't do the whole thing. There goes my mp3. Puff the magic dragon, right? Puff the magic dragon, 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 lived, lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn, autumn. Hanali, little Jackie Paper, Paper, love it, that rascal, rascal puff, brought him strings and ceiling wax and other fancy stuff. Oh, Puff the Magic Dragon lived, lived, lived by the sea and frolicked, frolicked, frolicked mist in a land called Hanali. Puff the Magic Dragon lived, lived by the sea. I got it done. and frolicked, frolicked the autumn mist in a land called Hanali. Together they would travel on a boat with billowed sail. Jackie kept a lookout perched on Puff's gigantic tail. Okay. But we still use the worksheet, even after we're comfortable. And we're looking and we're making sure that we're singing with meaning. So if a word is not real familiar, we're not sure of it, don't forget to look, slow things down, look at the, if you're Chinese, the Chinese words. Um, it, you do not have to understand perfectly, but this repetition goes much better if you're focusing and learning with purpose. Now, 25 times, two, five, five, two, five, 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 25 times. If it's a song you like, there should be no big deal. Um, just, you know, we talked about practice makes perfect. Oh, we said no. Practice does not make perfect. Practice makes permanent. The better statement is perfect practice makes per perfect. So, just like doing exercises to make your body strong, if you do them incorrectly, if you do them sloppy, you will not get the benefit out of those exercises. The same way with singing these songs. If you take the time, each time, don't rush through, each time, take a deep breath, focus on what you're doing, and go deep with the, with the song, enjoy it, get passionate about it, visualize what are you seeing happening in the song, feel it deeply. That is what's going to be the best exercise for your English. All right, so that's it for step two. You're gonna, I don't care how long it takes, just enjoy it and keep at it and enjoy singing. And don't do it in front of other people if it bothers you. Okay, so that's it. I'll be back.